Florida officials are sounding the alarm. Mandatory evacuations have already begun in the Keys tonight. The governor now urging the people of his state, the entire state, to be prepared. The track making all the difference, but either scenario, as we just mentioned, almost all of Florida in the crosshairs. ABC's Alex Perez is there tonight. Tonight, long lines, bare shelves, and frayed nerves as all of Florida braces for what could be the worst hurricane to hit the state in decades. It's very important that everybody in our state gets prepared. And take a look here at this Publix grocery store where all the sports drinks and water would be. The shelves almost already completely empty. People scooping up what they can when they can. The governor already declaring a state of emergency. This is category five hurricane, yeah? Yeah. So it's just like, it's really scary. So you have to be prepared as much as possible. For some, Harvey's destruction in Texas is fueling the fear. I saw what happened in Houston. Four feet of rain, they're saying this storm's going to be worse. In the low lying Florida Keys, mandatory evacuations, officials telling tourists to get out as soon as possible. Patricia and Valerie Lynn rushed here from Houston, where they were dealing with Harvey, now faced with a new storm. I looked at them and I said, We got 10 minutes, pack your bags. We're driving to Dallas, caught a flight. Monday morning to hear. Back on the mainland, the Broward County mayor warning residents not to rely on shelters. Going to stay with family or friends outside of the evacuation zone is the best choice since shelters only provide for basic needs. Hurricane Irma seen from space the strongest in the Atlantic Basin since Wilma in 2005. Is South Florida ready? Well, I'd say we're not ready. No one is ever ready for a Category 5 hurricane. In the 25 years since Hurricane Andrew, construction has boomed in Florida, which toughened up its building codes. During that time, nearly one in 10 new homes in the entire country were built in the state. The place has grown like crazy since Andrew. Uh, there are a lot of people who haven't been through this before. So let's get to Alex Perez live in Miami tonight. And Alex, we've seen evacuations already for the Florida Keys issued today. What are authorities right there in Miami saying tonight? Well, David, officials here are saying evacuations in Miami-Dade could start as early as tomorrow. They are also reminding people to do things like take pictures of their important documents, refill prescriptions, and, of course, very important, have a spare or alternative power supply for your cell phone. David? All right, Alex Perez in Miami for us tonight. Hi, everyone. George Stephanopoulos here. Thanks for checking out the ABC News YouTube channel. If you'd like to get more videos, show highlights, and watch live event coverage, click on the right over here to subscribe to our channel. And don't forget to download the ABC News app for breaking news alerts. Thanks for watching.